So welcome to 2023, and I'm sure everybody is excited and uh, looking forward to uh, making some changes as we always do every year. Uh, we go into another year, and 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 it's normal. You know, we decide we're going to do uh, healthy things, and we're going to go to the gym, and you know, sometimes that just falls off. So I'm going to try to give you some tips on. Uh, three things that I think are important for all of our members, and uh, I think it, it will be worthwhile uh, to both listen and see the text that goes along with it. So the first thing is every year I tend to um, pick a word, and I know social media, people do it, but I've been doing it for a while. So <clears throat> my word this year has been determine. I am determined to increase the amount of people that I can help financially in terms of getting a mortgage and bringing them their dream home. That's my word of the year, and I will stick to it all year long, determination uh, or determined. And that will hold true for other things like exercise, being in the gym and all that kind of thing as well. The second thing um, I want to talk a little bit about today is rates. You know, Prior to the holiday period, rates were coming down and people were getting a little bit excited that rates were starting to fall a little bit. And there seemed to be a little bit of light at the end of the tunnel. And then the holiday period came and everything went up and the media was saying rates went up and, you know, um, gloom and doom, etc. But do you know that rates have been going up in between holidays for the last 20 years? So we expect that next year, meaning this year, going into this week, next week, we'll see some rate declines. Now, there's a lot of things going on uh, right now, uh, politically, uh, landscape-wise, that may affect that. But for the most part, year in, year out, that has been the trend. So we're looking forward to that and helping you uh, and your clients with uh, rates because there are so many options available that it's crazy that people are not, you know, still jumping on the bandwagon and, and trying to get that dream house because there are options available. And the last thing is, and this is very important for everybody, when things start to contract in the business, many people pull back. I'm not going to do this. I'm not going to do that. And <clears throat> I'm not going to do the things that, because the business is slow, I'm going to stop doing these these certain activities, if you will. Now, the one thing I've learned over 20 years in this business is the worst thing you can do is contract. Because if your competitors are contracting, that's your perfect opportunity to fill the gap. So my advice would be keep plugging away. Do the things that you're doing, but do them even more so. So, um, you know, contacting others and getting out there and being the face of the your own business because that's what it is, your own business. So I would say that when things start to slow down, speed up, and you're going to see that 2023 will be a great year. Thanks very much. I look forward to working with all of you. Uh, we have a Lunch and Learn coming up January 10th, uh, and we'll have some information out shortly about that. But it's a little long of a video, but I want you to get some, you know, some points across. And uh, so there you go. All right. Thanks a lot. Look forward to talking to you again and look forward to a fantastic 2023.